you upset about something? No. No, no, it's... it's... You know what? Yeah. Actually, I am. Let me guess. The quacking ducks. How can you think that it's wrong? Well, I never said it was wrong, Jen. I said it was a choice. So then you think it's okay? No. I think it's wrong. It's in the Bible. Mm. Hey, Mrs. Ryan, what's the chapter that, that condemns homosexuality as a sin? I believe it's in the book of Leviticus. Graham, I... stay out of this, please, okay? I'm not gonna let you two gang up on me here. How can you have such a narrow view about being gay? How can your view be so narrowly liberal? Ted, you're no saint, you know that. I don't claim to be. But one day, I'm gonna have to answer to the big man, and so will Jack. And if he's ready to take responsibility for his actions, then he can do whatever he wants. I just think that his kind is damaging to the world at large. I cannot believe you. For you to suggest that somebody can just magically decide to be gay is insane. The facts don't lie, Jen. The gay movement has been nothing but medically and morally damaging to this country. What? I've tried to stay out of this. I have, I, I, but I can't, Jennifer. Now, if no, you just no, let me Graves, explain. I am not going to let you guys moral majority me here. I mean, you don't even know all the facts. What I have to say isn't directed at you, Jen. What I have to say is for Tyson. Well, all I'm saying is If that... Jack is gay, he does not need your judgment, young man. The Lord above will be the one to judge him, as he will all of us. What he needs from you, from me, from everyone else in this world is love and tolerance. If anything, that boy must feel scared and alone, and he will need the understanding of his fellow man to help him through this. Let's save judgment for someone much more experienced than you. <laughs>